Hey, folks, this is Gareth Soloway from InTheMoneyStocks.com with a trader tip for you. All right, we're going to look at the forecast for construction and home builders going into mid-year. And the key here is understanding what the charts are showing us. So let's take a, take a quick look at the charts and see what they are telling us. Number one, we are clearly seeing a triple mountain top on the XHB. This is the home builders chart right here. You can clearly see that it's basically putting in this triple mountain top. This is a very bearish indicator, all right? The reason it's bearish is because what it's showing you is that as you went up, sellers emerged and pushed it back down. The next move up, it made a slightly higher high, but again, it pushed was pushed down by sellers. Here, it made a lower high. That's bearish, folks. And the fact that the sellers reemerged means they're more powerful than the buyers at these levels, and you have downside on the XHB. So again, XHB, I do have a target on this going into mid-year. We're looking at a potential pullback to right around $65.50 right here. Now, if we look at DEER, let's take a look at DE. I want to show you the monthly chart on this. The monthly chart is also putting in that same sort of choppy higher uh, highs that kind of resemble that triple mountain top bearish formation. All right. And again, notice the high here and then the lower high, the lower high. Each push up is being met with institutional selling. And that, again, is a bearish indicator. The same thing can be seen on Caterpillar as well. Here's your big push up. It's trying to get back there, but so far unsuccessfully as we head into year, mid year. Now, the key is to understand what's going on on a fundamental basis. So, what you have going on is the Federal Reserve hiking interest rates, or at least they're threatening to, they're tapering, which is tightening in and of itself, and they're threatening to reduce their balance sheet. These are all things that are putting pressure on the 10-year yield and interest rates as a whole, which makes sense why you would be seeing distribution, which is institutional selling on the home builders, the construction stocks, all these type of things going into the near-term period, which likely will translate into further downside into mid-year. So that's your trader tip update going into the forecast for the construction and home builders into mid-year. You guys have a wonderful rest of your day. My name again, Gareth Soloway from InTheMoneyStocks.com. Go to businessfirstam.com for where to see our show on TV.